students it's me rashid ayu professor of mathematics today i will teach you how you can find out the integration with minimum time few question which has appeared in different entrance exams and you can solve this question using the technique integration by parts but not right now i am teach you how you can find out the integration of these two question without integration by parts and how you can find out the integration without integration parts okay if you have two function one is the algebraic and the second one is the trigonometry okay take algebraic function and the other one is trigonometric function you should take a derivative of algebraic and take the integration of the trigonometric function okay what is the derivative of x here 2x what is the derivative of 2x that is 2 and what is the derivative of 2 is 0 okay i want to take the integration of the sin x that is minus cos x and uh, what is the integration of cos x that will be minus sin x and what is the integration of sin x that is again minus cos so minus and minus will become positive so it will be cos x no students you get the answer how multiply these two quantities minus x here cos x multiply these two quantities first you take the positive sign now you will get the negative sign this negative and this negative will be positive so this is positive 2x sin x okay again multiply these two quantities with positive sign so it will be plus 2 cos x plus c so student this is your answer okay and another question which has appeared in the different entrance exam and obviously you have very short interval of time and i will tell you how you can minimize your time and able to solve such type of the question okay take algebraic function and the other one is the exponential function you should take the derivative you should take the derivative of algebraic function and integration of exponential function okay what is the derivative of x cube that is 3x square what is the derivative of 3x square that is 6x and what is the derivative of 6x that is 6 okay what is the integration of e2x so this is e2x divided by 2 and what is the integration of e2x by 2 that is e2x by 4 and what is the integration of this that is e2x by 8 and what is the integration of this term that is e2x divided by 16 okay now start multiply these two terms with positive sign the answer is x cube e2x 1 by 2 this two will be written as 1 by 2 okay now multiply these two terms with negative sign minus 1 by 4 And three x square e two x. Okay, write these two terms with positive sign. This will be six x by eight e two x. And now write these two terms with the negative sign. This will be minus six over sixteen e two x plus c. So, friend, this is your answer, and you can get. you can simplify as well as and uh, hope you like my this video so please like subscribe comment and share my video thank you very much